so in this video i'm going to be walking you through how you're able to see all of your chats from twitch kick youtube and even tiktok all at the same time using caster labs which is a free plugin that is compatible with obs and streamless obs that's going to allow you to not only see all of your chats but to also set up widgets and receive stream alerts from all of your platforms as well Now, the first thing you want to do is head on over to the official website, casterlabs.co. And I'm going to make sure that I have a link down in the description below so that you guys can go directly to this page. Now, once you get to the official website, you're going to notice that it says to download for Windows 10 and above. So unfortunately, if you are on Mac, this is not going to work for you. But I will make sure that I will make a separate video specifically targeting macOS users so that way you guys can achieve the same thing. So now if you officially are on Windows, make sure you go ahead and download this plugin. Now, once you download the official plugin, you're going to have to sign in with one of your stream platforms. I personally recommend just going ahead and signing in with Twitch. Now, once you signed in with your Twitch account, you are then going to see this blank page right here. So the first thing what we're going to do is connect all of our streaming platforms. So you're going to come over to where it says dashboard and you're going to come all the way down to settings. Now from here, you're going to go over to accounts and then you're going to connect all of your socials. So you can connect TikTok, you can connect kick YouTube and Twitch. Now, if you have a travel account or if you have a D live account, you can go ahead and connect those as well so once you have those officially connected you will also see down at the bottom that you will have the option to connect your spotify pretzel or even your music from your actual desktop now if you're somebody that is going to be using streamlabs obs and you want to have alerts sent from castle labs over to your stream then you do have the option to come up here and you can click on streamlabs alerts and the only thing you have to do is just sign in with your Streamlabs account. So now that we're signed into all of our accounts, let's go ahead and set up all of our chats. So what you're going to want to do from here is come up to your dashboard and you're going to notice that your dashboard is blank. So what you're going to want to do is come all the way up here to this little corner until this drops down and then you're going to hit this lock button. Now this drop down menu is going to appear and then you're going to click it and you're going to select stream chat and then you're going to come right back to that little drop down again and then you're going to hit that lock button one more time now you're going to see that your stream elements has joined the chat or your twitch has joined the chat it's going to say something's joined the chat so what you're going to want to do if you want to see like kick and all of your other streams you're going to come down here to the little icon and then you're going to select all now you're going to know if this works if you just come over to like twitch or kick and then you type in the chat you will see that it popped up for twitch so now let's come over here to kick and look at that you will see that kick also pops up so if i were to go over and if i were to use my youtube if i were to use tiktok if i'm live on those channels because it's not going to allow you to test it without you being live but if I was live on those channels, I will be able to see all of those chats as well. Now, your chat is going to look a little different from mine because you haven't set it up yet. But that's what we're about to do right now. So what you're going to do is come down to the settings gear icon, which is right here. And then you are going to basically highlight these settings. So you want to do either show badges, which you will see that it's showing my badges for either twitch or kick you can do that if you want to but what you really want to do is you want to make sure that this is checked right here to show the user's platform so it will let you know that it's from kick it's from youtube it's from tiktok and etc so you want to make sure that's checked and then where it says um show viewer joint or leave that's going to basically let you know if someone joined your chat so if you have someone that's just lurking, you will be able to know exactly who's lurking in your chat. That's up to you if you want to enable that. But you also do have the show timestamps, which I like that one. And then you also can do show activities for followers, subs, and ETC. I would go ahead and check that as that's going to give you alerts for whenever someone follows and things like that is will show up in chat. So once that's done, you want to go ahead and click the X button. 
and it's going to look exactly like mine so now that we've signed into all of our accounts and we set up all of our chats we now need to come inside of obs and we need to go over to our docs panel and we just need to create a custom browser doc so from here you're going to come back inside of caster labs you're going to go over to the docs section and then you need to copy your stream chat url once you click on it and it says that it's copied it you're going to come back to obs and you're just going to paste it in one of these slots and you can name this multi-chat once you click apply it's automatically going to pop up right here and then you can move this wherever you want so i can just move this right here and i can now see all of my chats now really quickly if you're somebody that wants to also add in alerts or any widgets using castle labs what you're going to want to do is come into the widgets and alerts section here and then you want to click on this plus icon and you will see that you have the options to add in your follow alerts your subscription alerts dono alerts as well as your rate alerts and then if you want any labels on your screen you do have the option to add those here as well as any form of interactions like having emojis fall down um, from your screen you can put this inside of obs as well and then you also have your goals and you have your others so if you were someone that signed in with your spotify you do have the option to add a now playing widget while using castle labs the only thing you have to do is just click on the now playing widget make sure that you are playing a song inside of spotify so you can see it in your preview and if this looks perfectly fine to you you can just click on this copy link and then you can just bring it inside of obs click on the plus icon and you just want to add in a browser source you can name this music click on ok and just paste your url and press ok it's automatically going to pop up right here and then you can shrink it and just put it anywhere on your screen so that is how you're able to see all of your chats while multi-streaming as well as being able to set up any widgets or alerts using caster labs so if you made it to the end of this video make sure you give this a big fat thumbs up make sure you guys go on ahead and subscribe as well as turning on post notifications so that way you do not miss a single video that gets posted up on this channel now if you guys have any questions make sure you leave them in the comments below or you guys can join my discord and i'll be more than happy to answer your questions there but thank you guys so much for watching today's video and i will catch each and every single one of you down there in the comments below or in the next video take care guys